I, um, I own a charitable clothing line. Um, it's a for-profit company that gives proceeds to various different children's charities that uh, we feel and we feel attached to or we feel like their mission is something that we uh, have something that we care about. Uh, this is actually one of the shirts that I wore today. This is goes to the International Justice Mission, which is uh, based out of Washington, D.C., and it is dedicated to rescuing children from sex trafficking traits. So um, that's one of my favorites. And then, you know, the, I'm a big t-shirt guy, but, uh, you know, something that I wanted to do with my life and, and try to make a difference in other people's lives, not just my own, because everybody at the end of the day wants to be successful. But if you can do that while helping someone else, you know, and children of all people who can't help themselves, uh, I felt like it was a win-win situation. So um, very blessed. I get to travel. You know, I've been to Cambodia uh, for two weeks last year, drinking freshwater wells, and uh, went to Alabama a few months ago to help with the tornado relief effort. Mm -hmm. um, I do a big lemonade stand in the park for pediatric cancer research every year. And uh, right now, I'm getting ready to plan a trip to Missouri for another tornado relief effort. So. Oh, wow. There's always people that need help and you know, it's such a eye-opening experience because w when I look at my life and I get to do this crazy TV show and compete for money and hang out by a pool and meet all these beautiful people and get to do this interview with you guys, uh, doing those trips is kind of like, okay, wow, you, know, you, you use this platform to do more and, and to really give back. And I've found that people receive you so much you know, better when you're open to helping other people. You know, right. when, you're, when you're not just concerned about where your station is in life, um, your station gets enhanced anyway, uh -huh. so everyone wins. Right.